Well, as expected, the Group 1 four-year-old Mayor's Gold Bullion Australian Pacing Gold event went the way of an Emma Stewart-trained Mayor, but as far as punters was concerned, it was the wrong one, with the odds-on favourite ladies in ready going down to Tough Tilly, with Joanna filling third spot. I caught up with the driver of Tough Tilly, Kate Gath. Well, Kate, congratulations. Another brilliant performance by Tough Tilly. If there, ever there was a horse that was well-named, this particular mare is. Yeah, it absolutely. She absolutely is, and she was terrific tonight. Forced to race without cover. How was your feeling on the home turn with Joanna, the stable mate, and then ladies in red starting to loom? I thought she was a good chance of sitting outside Joanna and beating her home. Um, in the second um, quarter, which was, you know, really slow, really played into her hand. So I would never say I'm confident of beating a horse at Ladies in Red, but um, everything panned out well for us in the run. Yeah, 30.8, that sectional, 28.7 the third, wrapped up in 26. Yeah, she just consistently runs 26 quarters in her races. And prior to tonight, she'd um, trialled and, and raced and just been absolutely jogging in 26 quarters, like pretty much running over the back of them. And I've never had a horse feel like she's felt. So, um, you know, I think tonight it's no surprise that she, she was able to do what she did. What a wonderful position. Emma Stewart and Clayton Tonkin are in. Three outstanding performers. There's still a lot of exciting clashes amongst them. You've got a feel for Joanna. She just keeps running honest races, but the two stable mates just keep knocking her off. Yeah, she's such a lovely horse, but she just doesn't quite have that, that little bit of probably extra brilliance that, you know, tough Tilly and ladies in would have, but you, you'd love to own her and, um, you know, there's obviously, you know, some great clashes ahead, but you know, ladies in red always does draw fair the worst draw, which makes it really difficult and she's overcome that plenty of times as well, so um, it'll be interesting going forward. Kate, a wonderful gesture by Ben Studd, the proprietor, Chris Judd, as far as his favourite charity is concerned. Yeah, the EB Research Foundation. Um, it's actually, um, it's not really heard of um, um, the disease, EB, and it's um, it affects young children and, and babies and, and can affect them right into adulthood. But um, it's a you know, condition where the skin um, just sort of um, flakes off and, and burns and everything sort of burns them. And it's just, it's awful. It's heartbreaking. And um, until this horse came along and, and Craig Dudd made everyone aware of it, no one had even heard of it. So it's really important that we can, you know, raise funds for it and help these children born with it and um, you know and adults that have the severe the severe version of it they don't live a really long life either so um, it's something that we really need to find a cure for and I'm just really lucky that I'm a part of it. And Tough Tilly did get her name after a very special little girl. She did you know Tilly Wilkes so um, yeah, she's a you know at the daughter of a friend of Craig's and I think they met through through both having daughters with the condition and you know she's just such a great girl and I've met her and um, and her family they're such lovely people and um, you know it's really Really good that we can you know that you know we could get a horse like tough Tilly and 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 you know um, to be as good as what she is because it's you know hard to get those horses but she's it and it's just fantastic a wonderful sport harness racing Kate that we can raise money such as this is kind donation from Chris but this month we're Raising money for breast cancer research, Team 2, which you're very proactive in, raising money for ovarian cancer. Through harness racing, we've been able to enhance the lives of so many people. Oh, absolutely. And, you know, um, ovarian cancer and, and now breast cancer, uh, you know, it affects so many people, so many women. And, um, and you know, it's years and years and we still haven't found a cure. And the only way we're going to do that is by, you know, just keeping on raising funds for, for the research to try and find one. So um, I take my hat off to everyone involved in harness racing that puts their hand in their pockets and gives to these, you know, well worked worthy causes that you know it's not easy people don't always have the money you know to, to just give to them but they do anyway so um we're a great group of people and you certainly play a very important role in that fundraising with all the winners you certainly steer home and congratulations on tonight's performance in the apg gold bullion for the mayor's group one and may the success of tough tilly continue and hopefully chris will be able to donate more money to that certainly very important research thank you